Hey, Psych2Goers. Do you sometimes feel like people are taken aback by you? Do they act nervous and fidgety in your presence? This can make you feel pretty confused because you know you have no bad intentions. But even if you mean well, your personality might be intimidating for others. If you're not sure if you're just imagining it or not, check out these six signs others are intimidated by you, but try not to let you know. Number one, they avoid eye contact. Eye contact can tell you a lot about a person's feelings. Do you feel like people avoid looking at you directly? They could be nervously looking around when you talk to them, or maybe they start doing something else to appear busy, like folding papers or checking something important on their phone. If this happens often when you're trying to have a conversation with them, it could be a sign they're a bit scared of you. Number two, they don't engage in conversation. Do you usually lead the conversation? You bring your ideas and opinions to the table, but others don't quite engage. This could mean they're intimidated by you. They might be afraid to voice their opinions or speak up, or they feel like they can't get their word in. Maybe they're afraid you'd criticize them for what they said, so they choose to just be quiet instead. Number three, they speak quietly or in a high-pitched voice. Another sign you could look out for is the tone of their voice. When someone is speaking quietly or in a high-pitched voice, it usually means they feel intimidated by someone or something. Of course, this doesn't apply to those who usually speak that way. Try paying attention to how they speak with other people and compare it to your last conversation with them. If there's a difference, maybe they really do find you intimidating. Number four, they agree with you on everything. Does everyone always tell you you're right about pretty much everything? And no matter the topic, people don't usually oppose your opinion. Maybe they're actually scared of your reaction. Disagreeing with people can be tricky, especially if we disagree with someone who we think is intimidating. Number five, they won't stand too close to you. We all have some people come near us and we tend to go near them, but we avoid the ones we're uncomfortable around. Do you feel that usually people avoid being close to you? Maybe they keep their distance in the same room as you, sit on a chair further away from you, or just simply take a few steps back when you approach them. If that happens, it could mean they feel intimidated and are trying to stay back to feel more comfortable. And number six, they over-apologize. Somebody accidentally bumps into you and that minor inconvenience is immediately followed by, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, I I'm really sorry. Of course, when some small accidents like these happen, it is polite to say sorry, but the difference is in the way the apology is brought up. Do they seem nervous? With a serious look on their face and eyes wide open? And even if you say, it's okay, multiple times, they still don't really seem relaxed? Well, maybe you could take it as a sign that you're intimidating them. So, do you think these signs explain why people act odd around you? Do you think you do actually seem a little bit intimidating? Even if you do, just being aware of it could help you. Now that you know what might be the case, try subtly letting people know that how they see you isn't really who you are. Smile a bit more, compliment others, or ask them how their day went. They'll surely get comfortable with you in no time. If you found this video helpful, like and share it with friends that might find insight in it too. Remember to subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell for more new content. All the sources used are added in the description box. Thanks for watching and see you next time.